McBride. Collier working one on one against Natasha Howard. Collier one way, then the other hits the shot. Nice move by Collier. Kayla McBride with the steal on the far baseline. Gets it into Collier. Fee draws the double, maybe triple team. Carlton open for three and hits it. She's made consecutive threes and has pulled the wings back within nine. But obviously Minnesota has to be prepared for that kind of run, just like against Liberty. A perfectly executed play. 13 points and eight rebounds in this first half. Sims off the dribble short. Offensive board to Kalani Brown, and she's still fighting for it. Fee comes away with it. Nafisa Collier just kept fighting for that basketball. Alana Smith on your hands when you're an opponent, but wide open three is not the way to get it done. Minnesota this season is shooting 40%, leading the league. Three-point percentage, Nafisa Collier gets a chance at a three-point play. That looks like we just saw right here from Nafisa Collier, just a little pump He's after the foul or no foul. What happens after the block? The ball didn't go out of bounds. So the Lynx get the possession and look at that fee off the glass and one. In that battle, every single time Monique Billings gets behind that help defense from the first quarter, but Dallas has kind of figured some things out. We got a substitution. Olivia Pupa in the game for the Lynx, trying to change up the rhythm a little bit. And Collier drives in and scores. Pupa. Gets it to Collier, who kicks it out to Carlton. Sets, fires, hits! Bridget Carlton with a huge three-pointer to bring the Lynx back within one. Scoring right at the rim from outside as well, trying to get this offense clicking on the road again.